we've, for some years now, have been very interested in the prospect of being able to harvest cells initially primarily to form myelin, which of course is relevant to MS. But I think through the years, our concepts have expanded in that one can use cells that can protect axons from dying, can protect nerve cells from dying, can encourage axons to regenerate, as well as replace myelin. And in our work, there's actually three primary cell types that we utilize at the moment. One is the Schwann cell. That's the cell that normally makes myelin in the peripheral nervous system. And another cell is called the olfactory and sheathing cell, which is similar to a Schwann cell, but it has some unique properties. Mm -hmm. And finally, we harvest uh, from adult bone marrow uh, from humans a mesenchymal stem cell that one could, in principle, remove from a patient harvest them and utilize them for cell therapy approaches. So are there some benefits to being able to harvest um, a cell from the patient that's going to actually receive the transplant? Tremendous benefit. Mm -hmm. That in principle one should be able to harvest these cells and the body would not reject them. And if we can teach them and instruct them how to repair it, it's very exciting.